Here's a message from C.J. Lovick, author of the widely popular Living Word in 3D series. Watch as he unfolds a mystery hidden just under the surface. In Genesis 1-1 we read, In the beginning God created the heaven and the earth. The word we translate into English as God is revealed in the original Hebrew over 4,000 times as the name Elohim. So let's look at the picture meaning based on the five letters Aleph, Lamed, He, Yod, and Mem in the name of Elohim. Aleph, pictured as an ox, it means the strong leader. Lamed, pictured as a shepherd's staff, and it means the one that has control and the one that speaks with authority. He, pictured as a man lifting his hands up to heaven, signifying that true revelation comes from heaven alone. It means to reveal. Yod, pictured as a hand, it means to work, a mighty deed, to make something. Mem is pictured as water. So let's summarize the translation of Elohim, the Hebrew word translated God, over 4,000 times in the English Bible. Aleph, the strong leader. Who is he? God the Father. Lamed, the one who speaks with authority. And who is he? God the Son. Hey, the revelator, the one who reveals the Holy Spirit. Yod does a mighty work with his hand that separates Mem, the waters, from the water. Think about it for a moment. Not only does God reveal the three persons in the Trinity, the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit, but he also reveals in a nutshell the essence of his creative work. The picture meaning of Elohim is revealed in the essence of his name. Elohim is God the Father, God the Son, and God the Holy Spirit doing a mighty work of separating the waters from the waters in order that we might have an earthly home. Genesis 1, 9 through 10. And Elohim said, Let the waters under the heaven be gathered together into one place, and let the dry land appear. And it was so. And Elohim called the dry land earth, and the gathering together of the waters he called the seas, and he saw that it was good. God revealed his name as Elohim, so that every time you considered his name, you would be reminded that it was he who created the heaven and the earth. We should marvel at the name Elohim. There are literally hundreds of precious mysteries found in the ancient Hebrew. To learn more about this word and other Hebrew words, subscribe to livingwordin3d.com and we'll send you a new word every week.